Hey guys, what's up? It's Wolf your one and only, and today we're gonna be playing some Dragon Blaze. And today is supposed to be update night for the whole Valentine's thing and the whole you know costumes coming in. I'm looking forward to it. Uh have I done these? No, I have not. Let's go ahead and do all these. I do have a couple of S's just sitting there. I have like a few runes in there, but I have not done anything with them just because as you can see my gold is dying right now. I have to hold off on that. But we are almost enhancement 15 for my encanter, which is actually really nice. And this is another reason why I barely ever have spent like rubies on shoes. It's just because I get all my shoes from here. So, yeah, pretty much kills two birds with one stone when I buy them from, like, um, daily. But I am curious to see how much it'll increase by. Okay, 20 is what I'm at right now. Increase to 30. Okay, so I just need seven more scrolls. Well, technically, four more scrolls after this. This should be... Wait, what is my number in my head right now? Definitely not the numbers that I'm looking for. <laughs> I'm gonna need six more scrolls after this. Like number just went straight over my head at that point. That's why. I, ew, why I don't do math anymore. The sad part is math was literally one of my favorite classes because it was just like the easiest one. But coming up with it on the spot, yeah, kind of not my strong suit. But you know, we're not gonna talk about that. But let me just go ahead and grab these shoes. Alright, now that I have these shoes, I could just go ahead and use those to farm. Okay, cool. Now then, this time, inside of Golem, we're going to actually have Prome inside of the group just to see that huge difference. And have we ever survived? Yeah, we have never survived the whole 10 minutes, I believe. At least I think so. Not fully sure. Hmm. Well, it really doesn't matter. As long as we get a bigger score, we're all good. But yeah, last week was our pretty much highest score for Golem. So let's see how it goes now. Seems like it's starting off all right like like I always say we can't be sure until we get there yeah we definitely randomly fell off like that was weird like everybody was attacking but no damage went through unfortunately but people did let me know that golem silences so, he probably could have silenced, um, Prometheus again. Poor Prome. He always gets silenced by everything. But it looks like we're catching back up. So he just needs to have one more recharge on his first skill. There we go. Hope we get it before it enters. Nope, we're not gonna get it. Unfortunately. But we're just like inches behind it. Then <laughs> it just randomly jumps up like that. Maybe I, I just have to replace Till with Ravengill again. Because Ravengill always increased our damage more than Till ever did. Mostly because of the boss damage, I'm guessing. That's just my like first guess on that. Alright, there we go. See, we're always like inches behind it until so we actually got it. 
Took us long enough. All right, let's see if we can continue that. All right, it seems like everything's going well. I literally just woke up like a few minutes ago. It's like, what time is it? It's literally 11 a.m. I normally wake up like a lot earlier, but I pretty much stayed up all night doing other things. You know, busy, 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 but it's so good. It's all good. I'm woke now. That's all that matters right now. I'm woke. Until I decide to, you know, pass out. <laughs> Which will probably be after I edit all my videos. Then when I, whenever I wake up, I'll just upload it, you know. But I do have to record Prey episodes just because I've been slacking on it. And for those of you guys who are actually keep up with the horror channel which nobody actually does but i'm just having fun with the horror channel really don't care if anybody else is like watching it or anything i'm just gonna have fun editing the uh, funny montage for it okay there we go Seems like we have somewhat sustain going. Somewhat. Oh god, I forgot to remember eyes. I forgot to remember the highest score. <laughs> god darn it. But we probably should be passing it though. So I don't think I have to really worry about it. Yep, we're still high. So yeah, we basically passed our score for this week. So that's pretty much the difference of having Chrome inside the party and outside the party. You always want your DPS, the people who do the most damage, inside the party. Just so they can get those um, formation buffs going. Which helpers don't get. I say those are for mostly buffers for helpers now the only thing I have to worry about is like sustain and that's it which I really don't have it much of right now but like I said before once they're ultimate they should have their own sustain at that point like Prometheus when he was max he Definitely did not survive a lot of hits. But now he actually does. Thank God. I definitely know we're not going to survive the 10 minutes. But I'm hoping we survive longer than the 7 minutes that we did last week. Oh, jeez. So, rip those two. But people are also saying that Priest is really good right now. A lot of people are enjoying it. To be honest, I was going to go from getting Encanter to 15, then going to Archer or Paladin. But everybody's saying Priest is extremely good, so I might go to Priest afterwards. We just have to see. I'm gonna go look at her skills right now, actually. So you guys are gonna come with me on that journey before we actually start Arena. Whenever these guys decide to, you know, get done with this. It's alright, guys. Die anytime you feel like it. There's one. Alright, thank you. Oh no, you're gonna keep going? <laughs> oh no, how you were still going with that no HP left? Eh, I think Prometheus hit a little bit lower this week. At least I think so. Well, you can't really tell with the whole challenge. They don't give you individual score anymore. Or at all. Alright, just a little bit above. 
It didn't like too much though. But we definitely did jump up from like mid range. Alright, cool. So let's go look at Priest. Because I have not really looked at her skills. Like I've glanced at it, just never really actually looked at it. Skill bug. Alright, so. Yeah, the hill all is still there. Magnify to the whole party there. Hmm. I don't know what I would want to build here. I feel like I want to put this into one. Probably put one in here as well. Hmm. Or I could put one into this and this. Or I could leave Magnify alone. Huh. I'm going to let you guys tell me how you all build it. Because that's going to be interesting. Because I barely ever played Priest. I think I started out leveling her, but then I just got bored of her and just went on to something else. But that was before this whole changes came in for all the characters. Auto statuses actually look pretty nice as well. And healing amount. Eh, I would probably go for this for transcended. And I'll go for this for ultimate. I'll figure something out. I just never felt like leveling up these characters just because I don't feel like going through the whole story again. You know? I, I know you guys feel my pain. I just want to stay in one area, grind all the way up to max level. Instead of going through every last bit of story that I've already been through. Just to get to that area that I just want to sit there and farm in. Yeah, I want to avoid that, but, you know, life, life has other plans. A lot of different other plans for me. Okay. Now we're in arena. Let's go ahead and do this. a little bit tired. <laughs> Not all the way woke, but you know, I'm kind of woke. Kind of, kind of. Easily going into a coma right now. Just easily going into there. Oh, somebody was using Sasha key. And people saying that Sasha is still pretty strong to be honest Sasha was always extremely powerful so I wouldn't even doubt it it's just unfortunate that she, she won't be a thing anymore and I don't have any encounters just to enjoy her last moments Unfortunately. But if I was to say, my favorite keys would have been Sasha and Asker. Asker mostly because of his look. His look was amazing. As for Sasha, it was mostly for power. She was pretty much my go-to key for power before trans came in. Before trans came in, you know, everything was a lot different. <laughs> I still kind of like that shield, but his sword just looks so weird. 
Kind of sweet. We transformed Graysoul into a fox and murdered him. What if you could make like a whole team of morphers and just transform the enemy team into random things and just pretty much destroy them? I mean, easily done with the mage character and, Fo and Foxy. Who else? Sadly, the only ones I know that can actually do it is Foxy and I think a couple of DFIs or a DFI can also do that. Huh. Don't remember who it actually was. I know it was like I was about to say it was the Encanter. I think it was a mage that did it. Dude, can you win this 1v1? That's the true question here. Well, he's not taking any damage. You're not taking any damage. There's clearly something wrong here. Oh, no. There you go. All right. Good job, Winlow. <laughs> you carried the whole team. Now, how much time do we have? We have a good uh, five matches to go through. Let's say that. Not counting this. Five matches begin now. Ah, this could be easy. You never know with this game. I've seen people's with just like normal max characters take out a whole team of like ultimates yep it's a thing and it happens a lot okay one thing I definitely need to do is take out fire support Alright, so they kept out Helios. Yep, rip. Alright, next. I mean, was that just one? Oh, no, that was our second one. This is our third. is the fourth. I don't really see trigger around often. Got a surprise. Somebody's still carrying around Tanuvian. Mm. Everybody wanted Trent's Tanuvian so bad just because that ass. Just saying. That's mainly the reason why everybody wanted her as a trans. Also a reason why I wanted her as a trend too. Not even gonna lie. Oh jeez. Ah, that sucks. But you know when you got the Titan healer, she's constantly giving back like HP from the damage you do. Really good for PP, I can say that. And okay, we got Atlas, the pretty much PvP queen. Especially when she's ultimate. There is no stopping that woman. All right, let's make this one our last one. Ooh. 
These guys do not want to die. But I keep thinking about it. Stormbearer has like... Well, Stormbearer pretty much makes your whole team tanky towards like physical damage. So, yeah, I guess I can see why it feels like, you know, you're doing less damage. But yeah, guys, hope you all enjoyed. I'm going to go record the rest of my videos before I pass out. So, yeah, hope you all enjoyed. I'll see you guys next time. Peace out. Meanwhile, on the horror channel. What the fuck is that? Get the fuck up off me. I don't know what that is. Man trying to shit me to the shadow realm. I'm good. <laughs>